Hello guys, what is up? Welcome back to another episode of Trove. In this episode, we will be looking at Father Time, aka Ice Age. So what you're going to want to be looking for is Energy Regen because you're mainly going to be using your right click ability, which is summoning the icicles. I think that's what it's supposed to be. So I think only your weapon can have en energy regen on it. I don't think any of these can. Now, some people that I know will actually say go for this ally, but I really don't know why you'd want to do that because you would be wasting 20% magic. And to be fair, look how slowly this goes down. So yeah, that's really slow. So the chances of you actually killing a boss before your energy actually goes down is really slim. Like the chance of you running out before you actually kill the boss. Now, if you manage to actually freeze a boss and then just sit there and right click, you can actually kill them without taking any damage. The only problem comes when you rush to the boss and you right click instantly, because if you do that, you have a chance of the boss still being able to summon minions, which that's kind of stupid to be honest, but oh well. So what I like to do is, hello licorice guy. <laughs> What I like to do is I like to wait a second or two and, until they actually, you know, spawn the minions and then I'll freeze them because I don't want to be dealing with, I don't want to be dealing with minions while I'm trying to kill stuff. Now, I really don't like Canadoria mainly because actually, let me turn my volume down, I don't actually, yeah, I like to have this lower. So, I don't like fighting Kandora enemies mainly because just because the licorice one lo loves to spin a lot. So let's see, freeze them, and then it doesn't matter which, like if you uh, um, just use your ultimate and then use your flask, I don't think it really matters. It probably does because, as you could see there, I think I actually wasted a lot of time drinking the flask. Not really, <laughs> like I wasn't prepared for that or anything. Whoa. I'm just waiting for myself to teleport to the ground after that leg spike. Well, I fail, so anyway, let's go to the next dungeon, the Dungeon, and see what we can do. I see that three star, I want to go to that after this. Now, Ice Age is all the way ultimate does not take that long to actually charge up so that's good because as you can see we already had it charge it up and it does do a lot of damage without the sure strike and the arcane emblem I think it did like 100k which that's actually a lot for just ice age considering considering like it's like an ultra class and all that and sorry for the leg I don't know what's up with that I had to like reinstall the game and <laughs> random stuff I don't know if that's messing with it or anything I don't think it should be because usually after you know like when you do a fresh install usually the games like better but I don't know <clears throat> <clears throat> maybe it like auto set it auto auto set it auto set whoa dude I just want to dig down come on I think when I reinstalled the game, it like auto set some options that it thought my computer could handle when you know it can't. And I don't know what I'm doing, so freeze all these guys, and bam. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Well, geez. <laughs> well, that didn't go how I wanted it to. Mainly because of the stupid enemies wouldn't let me go down to the final floor. I hate when that happens. Well, look, the thing is I shouldn't be using my dumb laser to actually go down there. Three star boss is down there, but whatever. I don't feel like going to it since that flux guy seems like he's already got it. So that dungeon is done. The other thing I need to do is I need to test it, like test my right click and my normal click on a enemy. So let's see. Jeez. Okay, let's see, about 13k-ish. It does slow enemies down, which is nice too. But, 63k? Hmm. 
I guess that's decent considering it also slows down the enemies, but you still don't really want to be using it. Your right click is a lot better for stuff like that. <clears throat> so I just want to do this on a 3 star boss. This dungeon. I don't like this dungeon. No one does this dungeon legit. Like, there, this is a 3 star and there's like, you know, those two other bosses like a traditional 3 star. But no one does those. Everyone just... Okay. Well then. Hmm. I'm lagging really bad. I don't know why. I don't even want to check my ping because my ping is probably like 1000 or something. So yeah, like I was saying, normally you do the, the like other one star bosses, but not in this case. You just skip to the three star because ain't nobody got time for that. Okay, so you freeze them. There was a delay on the freeze there. See, and that's what I'm talking about right there. It summons the minions even as the boss is frozen. Now, that wasn't too long. That was actually good, at least by my standards, because how I think of it is, if the thing can, like the thing, if the class can kill the boss within, like the three star within two flasks, then I think it's decent. It's not the best. And I just think it's good considering how it's like an old class and like I've been saying, they don't give the old classes love because the devs are dumb. I don't know why. So the liquor slasher, I don't like this guy. Hmm, I didn't, like I never knew how fast the Ice Age's ultimate actually charges up. That's really good, to be honest. The other thing is I keep on forgetting to use my one ability or actually I, d I think I am using it it's just going away before I can even do anything making it kind of useless now it does increase your damage along with your movement speed I don't think it affects attack speed it might but actually yeah I think I think it's movement speed no it's attack speed and damage let's see yeah, 14, almost 15, so it is doing more damage. Hmm, nice. So, where do I want to go? We got, we have a house, and then we have that ice cream. I'd rather go to the ice cream, but oh well. This house makes me lag. I think I actually mentioned that a long time ago in a previous video. I don't know why, like my FPS just drops when I'm here. I don't know if it's this costume, but like, well... <laughs> Why would I say costume, but, like, for some reason the Ice Age has been a lot laggier recently. Like, as you can see, every time I'm using my ultimate, it's like taking a second before the boss actually freezes. Now, I don't know why it's doing that, but, whatever. <laughs> Man, I did not realize the Ice Age's ultimate charge it that fast. You can technically use your ultimate on every boss. Hmm. <laughs> Good class indeed. <clears throat> that is, if the, it depends on how far the boss is. Like if there's just two dungeons right on top of each other, then I don't know. The other thing is, is he good on the cursed skulls? Because that's a thing I haven't even tested yet. <clears throat> now the chest might be a problem I'm getting. So I don't even know if I should be going for the chest. I don't see why I do. I don't really pick up the loot anyway. So I want to do a cursed skulls. There's like you know the two kinds of cursed skulls to kill 30 enemies and the whatever's <laughs> and the normal ones. Now let's go to this three side. Hopefully there will be another. Let's see, kill the cupcake, <laughs> the cupcake thingy. I want Cursed Skulls, usually this dungeon has at least one, yeah, Cursed Skulls in it. So let's see how this goes, I don't, I think these enemies are actually weaker than <clears throat> normal enemies just walking around. That might just be the kill 30 enemy ones, I'm not sure. But the only reason why these things are even bad in the first place is because of the, of the amount of time it actually takes for the enemies to come out. That's the only reason why it's bad in the first place. <clears throat> and using your ultimate would not be good there, cause you know, you'd kill your, you'd kill the enemies way faster than your ultimate. Like, 
You, what do, doesn't the alt last for like three seconds, three to five or something like that? I'm not sure. I think it lasts somewhere like that. I don't like. It seems to be doing that the three star boss, where it actually freezes for a couple. Well, like it doesn't actually freeze the boss for like a second. It seems like it's only happening with three stars. I don't know why it's doing that. So let's just do this one more dungeon and then just call the video there. I would like to get a, you know, the kill 30 enemies, but I don't think it's that important. <laughs> no one even goes to those dungeons, to be honest, unless you like the, the whatever it's called biome, the treasure isles. Dude, I froze you. Oh, my ultimate's not even charged. GG. Hmm. That's a lot of damage for for 230k. Like my boomeranger does like 130, I think. And <clears throat> I know that's like 100k less, but that's not doing that much damage when I <clears throat> kill them with the boomer. At least I don't think it is. So that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. In the next episode, have I even tested out like? Is there any other class I need to even test out? I think I did all of them. Although I'm probably missing at least one. The Chloromancer, did I even do that? I don't think I did the Pirate Captain and the Chloromancer. I don't know. I'll have to check. So in the next video, we will see what happens. So see you later and goodbye.